The Steinbeck Fire Department responded to an average of nearly one call per day in 2013. Fire Chief Cal Tave says there were 353 calls for service last year, four more than in 2012. Not all of those are fire calls. Motor vehicle accidents, we were talking, I believe it was 130 calls last year. Uh, false alarm rate is uh, basically the same as uh, last year as well. We're running at about 35% of our calls are false alarms. And Tave says when it comes to false alarms, there's nothing they can do to prevent these. Most false alarms aren't repeat offenders. They're, they're uh, standalone situations. There are, um, from year to year, we'll get uh, a certain location where we'll get four or five calls per year. And they get their, it often comes down to uh, uh, issues with their system that they get repaired and the next year they're fine again. So it's not that there's... Uh, repeat offenders that we keep going year after year. The Steinbeck Fire Department a few years ago welcomed a ladder truck to its fleet. Tave says this truck came in handy last year. We used it a few times, um, but it was invaluable in the uh, Callington Park fire a couple of weeks ago. Um, where w Without this, uh, we don't have ground, ground ladders. Uh, tall enough to uh, reach the roof of that building, so it came in quite handy. 2013 saw Mark Lowen step down as fire chief and Don Smith resign as deputy chief. However, the city has 10 new recruits, which will begin training in January. Reporting for Steinbeck Online, I'm Shannon Dewick.